There is a fantastic book that's only come out two years ago, which, and I say this as a non-Soviet scholar, but it has certainly done its homework. And I have that on the authority of, of people who work far more in that field. But they have revised the figure and it's not far from what the Soviet figure was, but it is very clear who is doing better here. The number of Soviet casualties in December, January and February is 1.6 million. That is phenomenal. If you put that on the bar next to the Germans, that's the disparity you get. It's one to six. Now you might be asking the question, well, how does that happen? How can the guys who are on the offensive be losing so much? Actually, that's not too much of a surprise. The most costly month for the Wehrmacht in the war until now, even if you go right to the end of the winter, was July, 1941. Being on the offensive is difficult. That means running into defensive fire. That means casualties.